Hey everybody, I am Stephanie Feld, and today we're going to talk about three simple steps to launch your uh, first intensive. So we've talked about how there's a myth out there that setting up intensives is really complicated. And certainly, like anything else, you can try to create this elaborate plan um, all the way before you get started. Another option is to keep it simple and just to experiment with what works for you and just see how it feels to you, um, how your clients react to it and that sort of thing. So the three simple steps or three simple ingredients to dip your toe into offering intensives. Number one is that you need to pick a format. So um, the typical format that I have used, there are so many. Um, depending on the type of work you do or the type of client you see, you probably want to customize it, customize it based on those things. But I um, offer EMDR and IFS, <clears throat> and I tend to do three-hour sessions for three days, and that may be three consecutive days, like a weekend, long weekend, or it could be um, three hours for three Fridays in a row or something like that. So first of all, you need to um, know, okay, how much time am I gonna invest in this? What's a format that we're gonna experiment with? And um, you'll learn something from trying it. It's the best way to learn. Second, you're gonna need a price. So um, certainly for, especially if you're starting with an existing client, you can use your standard hourly rate. However, intensives are just that, they're more intense. And so um, most people who offer intensives are going to price it above their hourly rate. And so that might look like 25% um, higher. Some folks who do like uh, offer outside their normal hours, like say you do a, a evening intensive or over the weekend, they may even um, make the price similar to overtime. So like time and a half. So just take that into consideration. And if you're just trying and you're not quite ready to, you know, set a premium intensive rate, um, then just pick somewhere to start. So you have to have a time to do it, dates. You need a price that you're gonna charge. And then you need a client to um, try out. And so I strongly recommend uh, starting with an existing client who's already on your caseload. Someone that you know, they know you, there's rapport there, there's trust there. Um, and simply you're just saying, hey, I am offering this new format of therapy. This is what it is. Here's how I think it could be really beneficial to you, um, giving them kind of the, the overview and tying it to their therapy goals and the transformation that they're hoping to see in their life or the relief that they're looking for. And then um, just asking if that's something that they are interested in. And boom, just like that, those three simple pieces, you're ready to try your first intensive. So anyway, I am so interested to hear your thoughts on this. I'm going to link a freebie below, which is um, my script to invite current clients to try intensives with you. So it's all written out there. You don't have to overthink. You can just read through it or send it in an email, talk about it in a session. But three simple steps to try your first intensive. So anyway, I hope that's helpful. If you have questions or you're looking for personalized support, please feel free to drop a comment below and subscribe for future videos about all things intensives. Take good care.